and bhagwan then says sarva guhya tamam so even more rarer than the rarer even more rarer than the knowledge which is the utmost the most rare is bhakti the rarest and the most secret of all bhakti is nothing it is said that it is the fragrance of jnana and it is the fragrance in jnana that is devotion see there is a story which is after the return of shri rama from exile and from after winning in lanka uh, to ayodhya after his return to ayodhya from lanka see when he was in exile and ever since hanuman met shri rama hanuman has always been with bhagwan always throughout every single time every moment with him performing seva and even when shri rama slept hanuman was at his feet performing seva now back in ayodhya you know after everything has been done at night rama and sita sita is now there and both of them retire into their chambers you know their room and hanuman follows faithfully as always you know he is always with rama or follows him. and sita gives rama this perplexed look you know what's going on here guys hanuman following us here and then rama lovingly tells hanuman that hanuman this chamber is for us only this is everyone is uh, not allowed especially at this time so you need to leave and hanuman is just standing there perplexed you know completely looking bewildered what is rama what is this bhagwan saying you know i can't leave. how can i leave and go it's unimaginable for him to leave and go so he is just standing there and rama just looking at him standing understands because he has been with rama throughout all every single moment so he tells hanuman that hanuman this sita sita ma she has the sindur which i have applied and that gives her the privilege to be in the chambers and this is our chamber and you are not supposed to be here at this point in time now hanuman didn't get anything of what bhagwan is saying and um, he but then he has to he listens to whatever sri rama says there's no question of you know even thinking anything other than what he says so he quietly leaves because it's god's direction god's wish the next day he goes to sita and he says sita ma what is this sindu and then sita explains that this is this vermilion which you know i pray for constantly pray for shri rama's health and apply which he first applied to me so hanuman goes to the market and buys like sackfuls of sindur and then at night he goes to shri rama's chambers and sita's chambers have completely doused in sindur they say no abhishekam full head to toe sindur and he says bhagwan i also constantly pray for you while shri rama is in splits at the sight of hanuman sita ma is actually crying marveling at hanuman's devotion that kind of bhakti you know actually guruji uh, swami tejo mahendra ji says about bhakti nirgune nischala nishtha sagune sarasarati which means devotion is firm abidance in the nirguna and absorbed reveling in the saguna we studied what was nirguna and saguna is in nirguna firm abidance and Ab- absorbed reveling in saguna like my mother was saying she is in sri rangam now she is absorbed reveling day in and day out in that saguna bhagwan beautiful description of devotion 